Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to create status here in Jira. Let's begin. The first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time in Jira, I need you to click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Creating a new status in Jira is a straightforward process that would allow you to customize your workflows to better fit your project requirements. Now, I want to make sure that we are on the uh, left side panel of our dashboard. And the first thing that you need to do is go to the product project settings. Okay. And after that, I need you to click on the workflows. Here, different projects may have unique phases or stages that are not covered by default Jira statuses. Okay. So creating a custom status helps accurately represent these phases such as, you know, like story bug, epic task, and subtask. Now, I need you to click on the edit workflow. You see, this is going to be the uh, diagram for the workflow, right? Done in progress, and that's that. I want you to click on the add status here. Now, you can rename the new status for as long as you want. For example, awaiting information, close to clan in review open pending reopen and a lot more work in progress so i leave with the discretion to you but in my case i'm going to put in something like how to create a status in jira all right just like it after that you see there's going to be a square here that allow all statuses to transition to this one i need you to check that it's very important okay and click on add now description is maybe this and the category it's all up to you maybe you could use in progress or done okay so uh i'm gonna make sure that it's gonna be done all right so it helps identify where an issue is and if it's life cycle all right and i need you to understand and read this simple information here and click on create after that you see this is gonna be around here we want to make sure that this is now if you wanted you also have an option to add transitions this is very important if you wanted to make a uh, if you wanted a more control over the status here in jira okay so i'm going to add a transition from a status all right so from uh, this no i'm gonna be using from in progress to how to create status in jira all right i'm going to rename this as maybe as i'm going to rename as deep laughs and i'm going to put a small description screen is going to be like maybe this one i don't know default screen click on add yeah that's right or you can reuse a transition let's try this variant there you go so let's cancel that all together but anyways this is going to be how you can of course create a status here in jira you can remove status if you wanted you also have an option for other properties where you can of course add new property to and the property value but we're going to do this in a separate video and that's it for today's um showing tutorial thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one